All right, motherfuckers. It's time for another fucking goddamn mobile walk and talk video with yours truly, M.O. fucking D. Raw fucking intolerance, the only way it will ever be on this fucking channel. Shout out to Mordant Red, Drusifer, Zach Goat Metal Show, Oath of the Goat Podcast, Shredbeard and Realms of Metal. Go fucking check out my fellow maniacs. They got some good channels. Also, Vincent Crowley. Hopefully, he'll want to come on my channel. Vincent Crowley, if you see this video, or anybody, share it out to him. I'd love to get Vincent Crowley on. The uh, mastermind behind, behind our Asheron would be really fucking cool to have him on. Um, as far as other collaborations, there's more coming. Don't worry. Uh, Drusifer and myself are planning to do some more streams. And um, going to be another collabs with Barry and Rich from That Goat Metal Show. Ulta the Goat Podcast and I are going to be starting a United in Goat's Blood underground radio show together as well. So we're going to be collabing as well. And uh, Mordant Red and myself, Drusifer hopefully will be on. We're going to, Mordant Red and I have planned another collab too. That's going to be fucking deadly. So that's going to be a great fucking time not doing that. So, pretty awesome shit with those guys. Always look forward to collabing with those fucking maniacs. So, tonight's mobile walk and talk. I'm up here at the, uh, I was out for coffee with a buddy and I was at the fucking, the, uh, the mall for a little bit, had a coffee, had some a salad, which I brought with me, but anyway. And it uh, started to get really fucking stormy here and then buddy was like, well, I gotta get on the highway and get fucking home because it's going to be fucking snowing and shit. So it's actually been snowing again, thankfully, because I love winter. And it was melting like a motherfucker because the temperatures were so goddamn high. So, anyway, so I figured, you know, walk home, do a mobile fucking video for you maniacs. Because I know you guys love this format as well. And I'll be back in the studio tomorrow for a Middle Album Warfares and my underground metal radio show, The Crypt Underground Metal Radio. I think what I'm going to do for those shows is like vary it up with different genres like one night will be just black metal and war metal another night will be like old school death metal slash death thrash another night will be like fucking funeral doom and doom metal another night I'll do some power metal and traditional metal stuff like that I think that would be really cool for you guys and I apologize if there's wind out here but hey fuck it do a video anyway so, getting to the topic of the video, I'm sure you've seen the thumbnail and the title. So let's get into the fucking video. So, oh boy, this one's going to really piss off a lot of these, uh, these fucking Slayer diehards who worship at the cock of Kerry fucking King. I, however, have never liked Slayer. Never will, and I fucking can't stand Kerry King. I think he's one of the biggest fucking posers I've ever ever seen, especially considering uh, his stance on certain things when it comes to um, just things he said. Lots of things he said in interviews really makes me doubt his credibility as a true metal elite. He's never been elite to me. His guitar playing is not that fucking great. I'm sorry, but Dimebag destroys you, Kerry. Um, but anyway, Harry King's new band, simply titled Harry King. The song is called Idle Hands. <laughs> oh, I mean, I listened to it, and it's the most mediocre, overproduced, fucking garbage I've heard this year. I thought new Metallica was fucking terrible. Well, Idle Hands from Harry King is a fucking dumpster fire. If I ever heard one, it is a complete fucking dumpster fire. Um, nothing about it is good. It's not heavy. I don't know why people consider that heavy when it's overproduced the fucking shit. And it just sounds so formulaic, contrived, and like they were going through the motions. I know the vocalist from Death Angel is in the band. Good for him. I mean, I'm not the biggest Death Angel fan either. I think Dark Angel is far fucking superior to Death Angel. That's my opinion. Don't like it. Fuck off. Um, everything about it just—it just has no. I don't feel anything from it. It just sounds like 
a bunch of old dudes trying to cash in on the name Carrie King. That's the best way I can fucking describe it. It doesn't sound like there's any inspiration, no emotion, like there's no fucking reason for it to exist. It's just about money. More fucking industry plants, and that's all Kerry King is to me, is a fucking industry plant. So, that's, uh, yeah, I can't stand it, and if all these fucking Slayer fans yeah, are gonna complain, let them complain. Yeah, I don't give a shit, you don't like my opinion, get the fuck off my channel. And, uh, go watch some other fucking clown who's gonna fucking conform to your points of view. This motherfucker won't.